Hi guys, this is Black Prism, and in this video I'm going to show you how to make a smooth pull strap lead. Let's further hear a demonstration of the sound. Okay, I'm going to start by creating a science patch and then initializing by going to menu and clicking on init preset. Okay, so for the first oscillator, uh, choose the pulse wave type, set the unison to 8 voices, and that's it for the first one. For the second one, choose the square wave type, set the unison to 7 voices. Disable retrieve, uh, lower the pitch by one octave, and lower the volume a little bit. Okay, go to part B, and in this also little, lift the saw wave, set the unison to 8, disable retrieve, give it quite a bit of detune, and set the volume to about 50%. Okay, now I'm going to put a an envelope on the sound, an envelope on the pitch of the sound. So go to here, click on this, and select pitch AB. Raise the delay a little bit, and turn this to the negative uh, direction so it pitches up. And also enable mono legato because I don't want to pitch it every time I play a note. Enable the compressor and raise the attack slightly, maybe a little bit less. Okay, now route it to a mixer track and add parametric EQ2. High pass the sound so it doesn't clash with the bass and the kick and the bull stuff. And cut a little bit of the low frequencies, not, not too much, something like this. And quite, cut quite a bit of the high frequencies, like this. And emphasize a little bit on the mids, something like this. Okay, now add a dimension expander to the sound. This is a VST which applies the Hass effect, which gives stereo to the sound. Uh, if you don't have it, you can download it, it's free, just google it. Anyway, set the size a little bit more than 50% and set the dry to about 30%. And lastly, add reverb to the sound. Not too much, but uh, so it gives it some ambience. Something like this, and uh, we're done. So let's hear the sound once again. Yeah, that's basically it. I hope that you found this tutorial helpful and I hope that you like the sound and uh, thanks for watching.